What's going on ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name is Big Fry and shout out to the Fry Nation. Guys, I want to talk about identity. I had a couple people hit me up in the comment section asking me my opinion of this of this game that's coming out. It's currently in like early development still, but we've been getting a little bit more information as of late. I've been watching this game for a while. I, I wasn't unfortunately part of the Kickstarter way back in the day, but I do plan on investing in this game when, when it's right to do so. I'm kind of in the same position as Star Citizen. I'm just kind of waiting until I see everything that I like and then I'll pull the trigger on it. If you guys don't know what identity is, they're touting this game as a new breed of MMORPG where you're not focused on grinding and leveling your character, but more so you're, you're focused on player interaction and role play. And it, it's made by the guys who did the Arma 3 mod, um, Altus Life, way back like when Arma 3 was first coming out. I believe their name was Asylum, and now they made a studio. I, I think it's called Asylum Entertainment. And these guys are making this huge huge open world role playing game massive multiplayer and in this massive world you can become police officers uh, paramedics uh, criminals if you want to go that route you can do a whole bunch of different things you can own your own house which you guys see on screen now they've just released this module where you can like basically customize your house and they show off a bunch of things that you can do with it it's really in depth now these guys are taking an approach to this game and this development the exact same way that star citizen is now if you look on their website they have what they call modules and you can you can buy into different phases of this test currently what they're working on right now is town square it's still in production you can't actually play it right now I don't know when that's coming, but what the town square is, it allows players to create their characters, interact socially, and enjoy some of the social features. And then you have SWAT and racing coming down the line. Now, one thing these guys have been pretty, um, I, 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 wouldn't, I wouldn't say terrible, but these guys haven't been very good at relaying information to the public. They've been very quiet for, for long periods of time. And it looks like they're starting to come around and realize that we need to start interacting with the community uh, this is one of this is one game that I am like really anticipating and it's not because we have seen a bunch of information that gets me interested because to be honest we haven't seen that much but just the idea behind an actual role playing standalone Altus life type game mode where you can do what you want, you can be what you want, and you could you could seriously role play. I, I feel like that makes a really great entertaining stream, and I, I wanna really dive into this when when we can do those things. I, I really think that this is going to be the game for that. We have things like No Pixel, which is like a complete pain in the ass to get on. We have Arma 3 roleplay, Altus Life and all that stuff, Daisy, and there's Daisy RP. There, there's so many different things. We need something that's standalone and not a mod, and I think this is going to be the one to, to do it. So I'm excited. I'm just waiting to pull the trigger just like Star Citizen. So that's where I'm at. Guys, let me know what you guys think of the project down below in the comments. If you guys have any more information that you want to share with me, we can start a discussion below. Use the keyword identity. That lets me know you guys made it to the end of the video. Thank you guys for watching. My name is Big Fry. I just wanted to give a quick thoughts on this project. And I'll see you on the next one.